Hey, my loves, what's up? So today I am coming to you with an update of my mini bath and body works collection, I guess. Um, I do have a few items in here from Victoria's Secret Pink, probably really not that many. I am super excited, you guys. I feel like my actual collection has shrunk tremendously even with all the items that I picked up and purchased throughout um, the winter sales and SAS. So with that being said, this is everything you see except for maybe a few items might be in my purse or at work or something like that or my working stash. I also have to do an empties which you'll see a lot of items that I just finished. And yeah, so with that being said, you guys, let's get into it. So I'm going to start with some of my moisturizing body wash. This isn't a moisturizing body wash, but it's in the family. It's an in-shower coconut oil body lotion. And this is, of course, as you can see, Coco Shea Coconut. And yeah, so the other thing, you guys, um, before I get off into this, I kind of have them in order because I was going through them. If you can see here, I don't know if you can tell, that is an eight. That means this product was from 2008 on the 297th day is when it was actually uh, manufactured to my knowledge. So yeah, just another tip when you guys are looking through your products. Next, I actually have two of the Coco Shea Coconut Moisturizing Body Washes. These are 10 fluid ounce bottles. I'm not really gonna go through any of the notes. I'm just gonna kinda get through this quickly, so there you have Next, it. Next, you guys, I have over here Beautiful Day, and this is the Super Rich Moisturizing Body Wash. I also have um, one of the JCBs, or Jasmine Cherry Blossom in this packaging here. And I also have a Pretty as a Peach in the Super Rich Moisturizing Body Wash Package. Then I have the Hyaluronic Acid Hydrating Body Wash in Cactus Water. I have two of the Fresh Sparkling Snow moisturizing body wash I have one of the champagne toast moisturizing body wash I went ahead this year and picked up a winter candy apple even though it's not like my favorite I think I got this during SAS so I have one of those going over to my favorite collection aromatherapy I have sleep which is black chamomile. I also have stress relief in the eucalyptus spearmint. And then I have two of my ultimate faves of the stress relief in the eucalyptus and tea moisturizing body wash. Now, I don't do a lot of the regular um, body wash from Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secret. Um, but I have this Papaya Paradise Cove. I also have two of the Sleep, which is in black chamomile. And um, as you guys can see, I am out of um, I'm out of the eucalyptus spearmint and the eucalyptus tea, which I typically do keep those in the body wash. So I'm out, I have picked up an At The Beach shower gel. And these two, I'm not sure if I'm gonna discard of them or not. These are definitely some throwbacks, but I found the, <laughs> the Tutti Dolce, and this is the Pink Peony Cream Shower Gel. And I have two of them. So for now, I'm gonna leave them in my collection, but they may need to be discarded. I have to check the dates. Next, moving on to the uh, body scrubs or sugar scrubs. This one is a sugar scrub, and as you can see, it moving, it has the oils in there. This is the eucalyptus plus spearmint of the stress relief. 
Um, this is my backup. I do have one currently in the shower now and I really like this one. New that I picked up this year during um, National Body Care Day was this Aromatherapy in the Balance which came out on 2019. And it's juniper and what is that? Coriander. Anyhow, this is a uh, clay body scrub, and so I have that to try. These aren't body scrubs, um, so I'm just gonna go through this really quick because I only have a couple. I have the cocoa shea, um, cocoa butter, shea butter, and pure honey um, body butter, and I also have the in the stars body butter as for the remainder of my body scrubs you guys i do have this here um stress relief in the eucalyptus tea i also have the stress relief in the eucalyptus spearmint and what else do i have here i have on the waves this is a sea um uh, sorry a sand and sea salt body scrub then I picked up this A Thousand Wishes Glowing Body Scrub. Isn't it so pretty, you guys? And I also picked up the In The Stars, what is it? Celestial Scrub. Beautiful packaging as well. I went ahead with one of the Gingham Whipped Sugar Body Scrubs. And this looks like it's gonna feel so so nice. I also have an at the beach sand and sea salt body scrub. And last body scrub I believe I have back here is a Coco Shea Coconut Richly Nourishing Body Scrub, you guys. So it kind of reminds me of like one of the moisturizing body washes. This product is a silk shower oil this is heavenly this is a Victoria's Secret product you guys so I just decided to um, pick this up I think I picked this up during this year's semi-annual and I also went ahead and grabbed the shimmering um, lotion in heavenly as well I also have this here this is one of the uh, fragrance pops and it kind of goes on like a gel um, in Heavenly as well. I also have a Heavenly Rollerball. And in the, um, one of the perfume brushes, I have Love. I do have Love also in the Fragrance Pop. I think it's in one of my purses. And then I also, in the Fragrance Pop, I have Teas. And these are all um, Victoria's Secret uh, products. My mist, you guys, had got so low. Um, but I'm going to continue with the Victoria's Secret since I just ended with that. This is Diamond Petals. Look at how pretty the packaging is on this. But yeah, so this is like the only Victoria's Secret mist I have right now, which is a surprise because I like their mist um, more than I do Bath & Body Works. Um, I also have a fresh sparkling snow. I have a Mediterranean blue waters. Capri coastal citrus. We have agave papaya sunset. Hibiscus Guava Freshka. And then these are in duplicates. I have in at the beach. My favorite that I did not get to stock up on, Forever Red. And then I have two little black party dress. These are my pillow mist, you guys. I do also like to spray my pillow mist in the air. I believe I have the eucalyptus spearmint at work at my um, desk or cubicle area. I have peaceful here, um, which I picked up during SAS. 
Then I have Sleep, which is black chamomile. And I also have the Stress Relief in Eucalyptus Tea. Here are some of the lotions that I have. I have um, in the body lotion, which I typically don't have this many body lotions, but another story. Um, this is Beautiful Day, which to me always smells very nice. I have Twinkling Nights. Fresh Sparkling Snow. Forever Red. Also have Into the Night. And Little Black Party Dress. Going with the body creams, I also have Beautiful Day. Sparkling Limoncello. Papaya Paradise Cove. On the waves. Then from Victoria's Secret, I have Diamond Petals. Coconut Passion. And Amber Romance. Also from Victoria's Secret, which I'm probably going to possibly discard of these. This is Sheer Love. Love Spell as a very old classic. And this one is just the Hydrating Body Lotion of the Coconut Milk, which I ended up using pretty much as decoration. I have some miscellaneous items. This is the, um, and I've been using one of them, so it's a little oily. I have the uh, moisturizing body oil, and I really do like using these oils, so I have those. And yes, they're in the glass jars. I have the Lay It On Thick Shea Butter Hand Cream, which I did a review on, as well as the 60 Second Manicure Hand Scrub. I also have Hand Hero, you guys. I was so upset I didn't get to stock up on these during SAS. Um, but yes, this is really good. Really, really good. Then I picked up some hair masks. So I have um, the hair mask for shine and one for strengthening. I also have the, um, this is pink. Looks like a charcoal uh, dry shampoo. I have a couple bubble baths. This is my favorite bubble bath from Bath and Body Works. And that is the Eucalyptus and Spearmint. So I have two of those. And then I picked up three packs of these. These are the uh, mini bath fizzers or fizzies <laughs> and Eucalyptus Spearmint. Have not tried those yet. I need to, but I haven't tried those quite yet. Hand soaps, you guys. I have this Kitchen Lemon in the Creamy Luxe hand soap, and I really like to use this in the kitchen. <laughs> I also picked up um, a Frosted Cranberry, so this is more of like a winter scent. I also have Winter Citrus Wreath, Fresh Sparkling Snow. We have two of the Eucalyptus Mint in the Creamy Luxe. Those are my favorites. I have the Cranberry Peach, and this is in the Foaming. I prefer that in Creamy, but yeah. Same with the Champagne Toast. Now I don't mind in Foaming is the Aromatherapy. I actually like it better in Foaming. And this is the Eucalyptus Tea. I have two of those because that's my absolute favorite. I have one sleep, which is black chamomile and bergamot. And then I have a eucalyptus spearmint. And then I have two of these in winter. This basket back here is super random, you guys. I have two of the um, 
Wallflower scent plugs. These are the dual Wallflower duels. Um, I have Lovely Dreamer, which is probably gonna be empty soon. So let's go with the minis winter candy. Apple body cream. I have gingham body cream. Pretty as a peach. Then we have some of these. This is um also like the body creams, the hand creams, I should say. This is stress relief and eucalyptus spearmint. I have two of these as well. This is the Shea Butter Hand Cream. Having Into the Night. Merry Cherry Cheer. There are a couple of the lip glosses. This one was Winter Berry. Cherry Plum Berry. Then we have some just regular lotions. Have White Jasmine, Snowflakes and Cashmere. That's it. And then the body washes. Oops, excuse me. We have One in a Million, Frosted Coconut Snowball, um, Twilight Woods. Sorry, I went blank. And then in the mist back here, I have Snowflakes and Cashmere. Pretty as a peach. More Snowflakes and Cashmere. The other two bottles. So I have three Snowflakes and Cashmere. Of the Wallflowers, I have, I was only able to get three of the Chris Morning Air. So Wallflowers is something that I probably will be stocking up on. I have jasmine and green tea. Also in the perfume, I have gingham. I have another perfume. Anyhow, um, Victoria's Secret perfumes, I have um, the minis. I have a bombshell holiday, bombshell intense, regular bombshell. This is from uh, Bath and Body Works, and this is a really good, this is really good. I have one at work, and, and then I have this one as a backup. It's a chapped hand cream, chapped hands remedy. Really, really good product, you guys. Really, really good. I also need to get stocked up on pocket backs. This is all I have left. This is um, Gingham. I have... Um, Watermelon Lemonade, if it will act right. Watermelon Lemonade. I love the Aromatherapy ones, and this one is Stress Relief and the Eucalyptus and Spearmint. Then back here, um, these are pink. This is the Coco Shea Wash. And so I have two of those. And then I also have a scrub. That's a Coco Shea. It's just cocoa wash, coconut oil, cocoa wash. And this one is a scrub down in coconut oil. I like face masks. I do pick up face masks from um, Pink usually. This is my first time picking these ones up. This is the Aloe um, Hydrogel Mask, and I have two of those. And then I have four of the Bubble and Chill um, Sheet Masks. So that's pretty much it. I do have a few um, men's care collection. I have Midnight in the Moisturizing Body Wash and Lotion. I also have um, Teakwood in the Regular Body Lotion and Body Spray and Bourbon, you guys. And that is it. I have Bourbon in the Body Lotion and Body Spray. And these will probably, Big Baby will probably end up using those. But you guys, my collection has shrunk tremendously, even if you don't think so, it has. Go back and look at my last two previous videos. Yeah, so with that being said, this is it. I hope this video wasn't too long, but I will see you guys and talk to you in my next video. Bye.